Mr. Speaker, on Wednesday, the President of the Treasury Board claimed that he had never been lobbied by the McCain family. We now know that this isn't true. In fact, the Minister met with Michael McCain in March, and the meeting was registered with the Commissioner of Lobbying. Mr. Speaker, why did the Liberal Minister mislead Canadians? The Honourable Parliamentary Secretary to the Treasury Board. Thank you, uh, Mr. Speaker. Our government takes our guidance on these matters from the Ethics Commissioner and the Lobbying Commissioners. The President of the Treasury Board proactively approached the Commissioner's office to disclose his situation and his holdings, which have been placed in a blind trust. The Commissioner decides whether a conflict of interest screen is necessary, and based on the fact of the President's case and situation, she decided against a screen. The Honourable Member for Elgin, Middlesex, London. Minister, uh, Mr. Speaker, the Commissioner decides based on the information they are provided. I just want to note that. Sure. So this is absolutely just another Liberal coming up with uh, what's ethics. It was this meeting with his close friend, what he just called a social meeting, just to let yeah. you know. <laughs> and why was it registered with a lobbyist or as a lobbying if it was just a social meeting? When would this Liberal minister stop misleading Canadians and admit that yeah. there is a problem yeah. with ethics here? Absolutely. The Honourable Parliamentary Secretary to the President of the Treasury Board. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. And our government takes guidance from the commissioners, the ethics commissioner, and not from the Conservative Party of Canada. So the, the President of the Treasury Board has proactively disclosed his situation to the Commissioner and he has followed her guidance. All of his holdings have been placed in a bright blind trust and the Commissioner has decided it is not necessary to have an ethics screen uh, in this situation. And I will point out that the person in question has publicly said that no lobbying was done during that meeting. <laughs> 